Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I am Tiffany. Thank you so much for tuning in for today's tutorial. So I'm trying to get into the how-to videos to really break down some of my makeup processes with you here on the channel. And today's tutorial is going to be all about the eyebrows, which to me are the most important thing or feature on your face that you need to make sure that you take care of. That's just my personal preference. Like I feel like eyebrows really make the face and grooming them, you know, in such a way to where it um, complements your natural eyebrow, your natural beauty is the best way to go. So there are several ways that you can go about doing your eyebrows and we will discuss those in today's video and I will walk you through the process on how I do mine and what products I use and what tools I use to do them in. So if that's something that you want to see then you'll have to keep watching. Okay, the eyebrows. The most important beauty feature to me <laughs> when it comes to doing makeup. Like I said, I could do it out the foundation, the lipstick, the lashes, all of that, but your girl has to have her brows on. And there are a couple of ways that you can go about doing your eyebrows. For me personally, I used to go and have my eyebrows waxed threaded I've tried it all and within the past couple of years I've just decided to groom my own brows so they may not be perfect which is fine by me um, but I had noticed after years of waxing my eyebrows a lot of the hair doesn't grow back um, and I just didn't like that so I just didn't want to make it worse so I just stopped doing it myself and I would groom my eyebrows on my own and if that's something you guys want to see then just let me know and maybe I'll do a video when it's time to groom these bad boys okay so for eyebrows, there's a couple of ways that you can go about filling your eyebrows in. You can use an, an eye, like an eye pencil, an eyebrow pencil. You can use an eyebrow powder or an eyeshadow powder, which your girl used to be really hard up on this from back in the day. And you can use a pomade. And a pomade is what I'm currently using to fill in my eyebrows. Now, disclaimer here. When it comes to the pomade, it's going to take some practice. So you're not applying the product too heavy to your eyebrows. That is the only thing. It took me a really long time to really grasp that um, for me using a pomade. However, it is to me, um, I've been using the pomade for a very long time. I think it's a really great product and it lasts very long. So that's another reason why I like it too. So I currently use the Anastasia Dip Brow, Anastasia Beverly Hills, it's the Dip Brow, and it's the Pomade. And the color that I use is Medium Brown. So it's the Dip Brow Pomade, Medium Brown, don't you worry, I'll link it down in the description box below if you're interested. And she has a lot of different colors. So you just have to find the color that closely matches what you're going for. Some people like to have the eyebrows darker. Some people like to have them a little bit lighter. So you'll have to find your preference when it comes to picking out the product. The other tools that I use to apply the pomade, I use two brushes. And let me get those over here. I use two brushes. To apply the pomade, I use the Anastasia brush here. And it has an angled tip on the end. And then after I apply the pomade, I actually use concealer to clean up the area. And I use this brush here, which is another brush by Anastasia. It's just a flat brush. It allows me to move the concealer wherever I need it to go, just to really shape and clean up that area. The concealer that I will be using in today's video and the, the concealer that I use when I do my eyebrows is by Urban Decay and it is the Naked Skin Concealer and this is in medium neutral if you're interested. Then after that, all I do is I'll take my sponge and I'll just blend it out. So let's get into the tutorial. If you have any questions about the products or anything like that, don't forget to drop those down below for me in the comment box. Um, and we're going to get into this video. Before we do though, do your girl a favor, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for me so you don't miss an upload in the future. I might as well talk, right? Okay, that's what we're going to do. So, 
when you apply the product to the brush make sure you apply it very lightly um, a lot of times if you get too much product on the brush you can definitely just kind of swipe it on the edge but you don't want to have too much because you don't want it to appear heavy so I just kind of pat it around in there make sure I don't have too much on the brush and then I personally like to start at the top So we're just outlining the eyebrow. Then I just take light strokes and just fill that in. And then we're gonna work on the bottom. By using a spool, you can help move product around that maybe gets stuck in your the hair there. So just brush it through just to give it a more even look. And just blend this up. So, yeah, I'm not, I feel like I'm blurry. So here we go. Product, no product, clearly. The next step, I'm going to just go ahead and complete this eyebrow so you can, and then I'll finish up. The next step, I'm going to take the concealer, and that is the shade I'm working with. I'm going to take that concealer brush, and I'm just going to take some of that off. And normally for me, I only put product on one side of the brush. It's just a lot easier for me to manage when it's on one side. So I have the product there on the brush. And then I'm just going to clean this up. I, once I start at the top, I like to start at the top as well when I go through the cleanup process. So I'm just going to take the brush, clean it up. I'm just doing the shaping there. See, not a lot of product. And then I'll go underneath and I'll bring this in. We are getting there and I just like to just take my time and get it just how I like it and I also take some concealer there in the middle and just blend this up now you cannot make it as thick but just continually 
swiping this way and you can make it up here a little bit thinner there and that is it for the first brow then I'll take my sponge it's still kind of damp and I'll just blend out that area you can also use a makeup brush to help blend that concealer out and voila so for me like I said eyebrows are the most important thing and it is probably the most for me the most time-consuming process in my entire makeup routine just because like if that pomade slips just a little bit or that concealer slips just a little bit it will throw your entire eyebrow off so a lot of times I have to go back in get a makeup wipe take it off let it dry and then go back at it again so like I said to me eyebrows are very important so I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna hush my trap and I'm going to do this eyebrow for you and um, show you that process so that way I'll have a complete face basically so yay so let's get into that and let me put this eyebrow on really quickly here see this one's a little funky you probably can't see it but the hair when I pluck my hair there's like a little a couple of strands there that I probably should have plucked off but I didn't I'll have to get those next time Okay, so that is it. That is how I do my eyebrows. So I guess it's like an updated eyebrow tutorial. Um, I don't know if it's changed much since my last one, which maybe has been like a year or so ago. I don't know. I'll link it. It's somewhere on this channel. Um, but thank you so much for tuning in and watching this tutorial today. Let me know if you have any questions. Um, if you have any questions about the products that I use, all of that good stuff, just hit me up in the comment section below. And as always, thanks so much for tuning in and I guess I'll see you guys next week. Bye.